Hello everyone, a few weeks ago I unboxed and briefly demonstrated the Loop Pure Cordless Vacuum Cleaner and today I'm going to give it a bit more of a test, in fact a whole house clean. Now I'm not at home, I'm actually staying in a holiday cottage on the northeast coast of England so it's right by the sea so you'd expect there to be sand in the carpets. Now the cleaner provided is a standard Henry cleaner, the sort of thing you'd find in most holiday cottages, in fact most of the holiday cottages I've stayed in seem to have a Henry or Henry type vacuum cleaner to use. So these carpets will have been cleaned with a Henry cleaner, straight suction. So I'm going to see how much dirt the loop cordless can remove from the carpets in this cottage. So basically I'm just going to go around cleaning the whole house, including the stairs, and we'll see how much dirt we've removed. Okay, without any further ado, I'll start in the living room. Let's get cleaning. Okay, well I've ended the whole house clean in the bedroom and it's time to empty the loop for the last time. I've been emptying it as I've been going along, but not showing you the process, but it has needed several emptyings. Okay, I'll empty it for the last time on camera. So there seems to be a fair bit of dirt in the bin. One thing I didn't show you in my initial video of the loop is removing the whole shroud and cyclone assembly. I showed you the inner filter, but it is possible to remove the whole cyclonic assembly. So if any dust or dirt gets trapped around this mesh screen, it's easy to remove it. There's not too much, a little bit of dust has fallen out. So for a more thorough clean, you can actually tap this. I'm just gonna tap it into the bag to release any fine dust and then at this stage if you want to you can give this a bit of a wipe with a damp cloth make sure it's dry of course before reassembling it you can actually clean the filter as well 
Now after that full house clean, that's the state of the filter. And you can see inside the multi-cyclone unit, there's some fine dust, but that isn't bad. I will need to clean this approximately once a month. Now this cottage has only been vacuumed by the looks of it with a suction only cleaner. So it has removed a fair bit of dirt in this first initial clean. I will continue to use this machine throughout my holiday and give it a good clean when I leave the cottage, make sure it's nice for the next guests. We don't like to leave a mess when we uh, leave a cottage. We leave everything as we found it or better in fact. So this will probably be a little bit dirtier. So now that I've taken out the central shroud, you can see there, if there was any dirt in there, it should fall into the bin. And some more dirt has actually ended up in the bin, I'll show you. So that fluff was actually in the top part. So I'll just make sure the bin is emptied. And there we go, it's completely empty. Obviously it's dusty as you'd expect. Now I can put back the central shroud like so again it's quite dirty isn't it and then I can put back the filter if for any reason you don't put the filter back correctly or the central shroud the loop cordless won't actually turn on and you also you've got to make sure that the bagless container is pushed fully into the machine otherwise again it won't turn on I found it can be a bit difficult to push the container back in. You have to give a firm push until it clicks into position. Now I'm going to put it in incorrectly so it's not clicked into position. So now when I try and switch on the cleaner it doesn't allow me to switch it on. Okay it's now time to show you exactly how much dirt this loop pure cordless has picked up just during this video. Obviously I've edited the video you haven't seen the entire clean and I haven't done the most thorough job. Obviously I've whipped around the house as you'd normally clean. I could move furniture and do other things to get even more dirt out but this is just a brief demonstration of a, a general clean. Everywhere looks nice and clean anyway. So let's tip out the dirt and see how much the loop pure cordless has collected. So there you have it, an awful lot of fluff that's absolutely packed with light dust as well. So if we remove this fibrous material, that is a lot of stuff. Look at it. If I move that to one side, we can tell, crikey, we can tell we're by the sea. This is sand, all this sand, look at it. That was all in the carpet. I mean, there was probably a lot of this was in the hall. That's where most of the sand would have been caught, but that is pretty <laughs> impressive for a cordless vacuum cleaner. Well, that's about the end of my video on the Loop Pure Cordless Vacuum Cleaner. If you have any comments or questions about this machine, please comment below. Also below, you'll find a link to Loop's website, plus their social media channels. So until the next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all very soon. Bye for now.